And many people more than ever are in need right now because of COVID-19. And the local organizations and agencies that are busy helping them in a normal year are having to adjust. As Fox 8's Michael Hennessy shows us, luckily, our commu local community foundations are here to help. The world is in a time of crisis. And for organizations that rely on donations to be able to realize their mission, there's an even greater strain. During this time, it has definitely impacted us and we've been faced with our own challenges. Uh, one of the biggest challenges is we rely so heavily on our fundraising during this time of season. For the Salvation Army of High Point, shutting down wasn't an option, even during a shutdown. It's those that come to us for emergency assistance, um, those that come to food assistance, and then we have a large amount of people that uh, actually are now seeking shelter due to um, losing their homes. So as people had to modify their lives around new restrictions, staying at home, job loss, the Salvation Army had to make some changes of their own. We had to put certain parameters in place where our case managers do a lot of uh, phone interviews now and gathering documentation um, over the email just to uh, try to find ways to assist clients. They had to close their building, made item pickup drive through, but the shelter had to stay open and with even greater demand. During this time, we've sort of had to modify some of our hours. Um, our emergency assistance hours are Monday through Friday from 9 to 12 each day. But it's not just food. The Salvation Army helps people pay their bills too. Well, for many years, the Salvation Army has been instrumental in these communities for us for assistance. Uh, everyone knows as far as when they're in a crisis that they can turn to the Salvation Army for resources. In the last few months, many lost jobs, couldn't pay their rent and utilities. Plus, with everyone inside the home, those bills got more expensive. That's where the High Point Community Foundation comes in. Through the support of the High Point Community Foundation, uh, we were able to ex um, assist more people with emergency assistance, uh, food assistance as well as provide um, additional sheltering for clients. Just one example of how this partnership is working together to help you, whether you're able to work or not. During this time, there's so many families that have come to us for assistance, and we want to be able to sort of show some type of support and assistance for them during this uh, financial burden. In High Point, Michael Hennessy, Fox 8 News. For more information on the High Point Community Foundation, you can visit hpcommunityfoundation.org.